Hi students, in the video, we have exercise 1.6 in the video. A survey of 1000 farmers found that 600 grew paddy, 350 grew ragi, 280 grew corn, 120 grew paddy and ragi, 100 grew ragi and corn and 80 grew paddy and corn. If each farmer grew at least any one of the above three, then find the number of farmers who grew all the three. Okay, so if you say what you are saying, we will say what you are saying in the Venn diagram. We will say what you are saying. Okay, so if you have a survey of 1000 farmers, then you will take a survey of 1000 farmers. That's why they are growing crops. Okay, so if you have a survey of 1000 farmers, then you will take a survey of 1000 farmers. That's why 600 group paddy. So paddy is 600 farmers. Then 350 group raw. Then 280 grew corn. Okay. So 120 grew paddy and ragi, and 100 grew ragi and corn, and 80 grew paddy and corn. In the information line, you could have to If each farmer grew at least any one of the above three, so male grew moon crop, like that, one crop had one farmer kandipa on the group and rare. Okay. So, so upon the thousand farmers, so that one crop on the valakranga. So, then find the number of farmers who grew all the three. Okay, so if you have three crops, who are the farmers? How many farmers are the three crops? So, that is the center part. Okay, so the center part is the same. That's why we have to take X. So, if you have 1000, I will tell you how to take the union. Or A union, B union, C union. That's why we have to take the center part. So, now we have to take the farmers in the third crop. So, we have to take the center part of A union, B union, C union. If there are 500 farmers who don't grow any of the crops, we can use the universe. So, what do you think of 1000? What do you think of A union, B union, C? What do you think of A union, B union, C? What do you think of A union, B union, C? That's what you think of A union, B union, C. So, what do you think of A union, B union, C? 600 is the n of a and 350 is the n of b and 280 is the n of c. Okay, so in the 120 is the a intersection b, then this is the b intersection c, then this is the c intersection a. Okay, so now we use the formula. So in the middle part, we can use the formula to solve the formula. Okay, so formula is the n of a union b union c is equal to n of a plus n of b plus n of c minus n of a intersection b minus n of b intersection c minus n of c intersection a plus n of a intersection b intersection c. Okay, in the formula use pannu ye, kandu pidu charla. Right, if n of a union b union c is 1000, so 1000 is equal to n of a is 600 plus n of b is 350 and n of c is 280. Okay, 600 plus 350 plus 280 minus 120 minus 100 minus 80. Okay, then plus n of a intersection b intersection c is equal to plus x. Okay, so 1000 is equal to so 600 plus 350 plus 280 पातेंगे ना 1230 वंद्रों माइनस 120 plus 100 220 plus 80 300 न वंद्रों plus x ओके बा सो अपन 1000 इसी कोल्ड टू 1230 minus 300 अपने इंग्रज़ अपो 930 वंद्रों plus x सो अपो 930 plus x इसी कोल्ड टू 1000 देन x इसी कोल्ड टू 1000 minus 930, so x is equal to 70. Okay, ma? So, if we use the middle term, we use the formula to use the better. Okay, first thing, then x order value than k trikanga, so x order value is 70. That is, the number of farmers who grew all the three is 70. Okay, that's all.